This one we're almost painting a rainbow. Cupcakes are one of the most famous and popular sweets of all time. So it has been a task to all bakers to make their cupcakes very uniquely designed and decorated. Today we came to one of the most popular cupcake places in Sydney and they're going to reveal their secret to their popular cupcake decorations. Get your pen and paper ready. Anna, I see so many cute cupcakes that you have and you have very famous workshops for kids' birthday, for adults who are like me, want to have a better looking cupcakes in general. How do you get inspired to decorate the cakes and do you think creativity is important in what you do? In order to do a business like this, it not only has to taste great and look great, it has to be creative and it has to evoke a sense of nostalgia yeah. and creativity from the person that, that's making and eating that cupcake. Cupcake. Anna is called the queen of cupcakes for a reason and here is why. It's interesting because people come here and they say, I don't know, I don't know what I feel like, you decide. So when somebody walks in, I in instinctively get a feeling of what cupcake will be right for, not just them, mm. but them in that particular moment. Can you mm -hmm. tell me what's going to be a good mm -hmm. match for me today? I got it. Okay. What would it be? What would it be? It's pink lemonade. For our buttercream, we need butter, icing sugar, vanilla, and a bit of milk. And then you end up with a box of buttercream. Oh, like, like that. This, yeah. Which is what we're going to work with today. <laughs> We've got a disposable piping bag here. Mm -hmm. We're going to start by popping a nozzle into it. Let's make a start. Yes. So we're going to attempt buttercream flowers. Thank you. We're going to move on and make the rose. The rose. This one we're almost painting a rainbow. Oh, okay. Now I see what you mean. It's like, a, like that. Almost. With that drawing it, you've got to allow it to fall into a rainbow. Yes. I can't get rid of the drawing part because I'm like... <laughs> um, try and lift your, your nozzle up and over. That's it. It's better. Let's go to the cupcake. Good. Mm -hmm. I'll show you one more time. We're starting here and we're ending here. Mm -hmm. Up, over. We're going to go from left to right. And there we have it. Perfect rose. Okay, so time for the purple, one of my favorite colors. Mm -hmm. Is it this one? Mm -hmm. mm. Is it easy? <laughs> yes. Okay. All you have to do with this one is squeeze. Good, I think I can do that. Good. <laughs> so, when you're working with two colours, it's really important to have white mm -hmm. and a very contrasting colour. Mm. So that's why we've got to go with a nice strong purple. Mm -hmm. So we can't use something like light yellow, light no, you pink, because it won't be visible. This is the trick to create two coloured cream. And the Queen of Cupcakes showed me an example. it from the side and create a wall. Yeah, it's getting there. You're getting there, you're getting there. <laughs> Just practice. Beautiful, that's this your best one. one. And it came to the very edge. Very edge. It's okay. Life is not fair. Just go slowly. So now that you feel that you're proficient in that, yeah. shall we do, do it again? Finally, when I could create one perfect one, Anna added some dreamy leaves to it. We are preparing for the second type of rose, which was super easy and quick. We're starting perpendicular to the cupcake, mm -hmm. and we're squeezing, and we're gently and slowly easing our way around 
Rose. So that's the end of the workshop for me today. I think I learned different flowers today, which is amazing. I was a terrible student, but Anna was amazing to teach me. You were amazing. Oh, you don't you. give yourself enough credit. <laughs> she was amazing. Thank you so much. So if you want to know more about Anna's beautiful cupcake store or workshops, and if you want to come and make one of these yourself, go to the link below and you can look for more information in the description as well. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you all next time. Have a beautiful, sweet, colorful day. Bye!